Sasha Peters that was filming Pretty Little Liar. She started a cooking blog, which then morphed into posting cooking videos on YouTube and became wildly popular. How cool is that? Now she just released her first cookbook, Sasha in Good Taste, recipes for bites, feasts, sips, and yes. celebrations. Okay, Sasha, I am yes. fired up. We're okay. making jalapeno poppers. What are we making? Yes, they're, they're jalapeno bites. So they've okay. got peaches, they've got spicy jam, they've got jalapenos, obviously. Oh. And all in a phyllo dough. They're delicious. They're so easy. Let's get started. What do we do? Okay, so I've already greased these with okay. some butter. What you would do is you'd use a cookie cutter or any two and a half inch round okay. cookie cutter. You cut around it. This is phyllo dough. It's very flaky. Yes. Um, for our benefit, we've already cut a couple out. You're one so step they're ahead. Ooh, look at those. Oh, no, they're so okay. Flaky. Okay. Boom. So you, you yeah, you put, so you put that a baby couple in, in there, there, right? Yes, you would gotcha. put a couple in there. This is just for our benefit is that a right now. Butter? This is a little egg wash. Oh, a little egg wash. Yeah, we're gonna put that around. Okay. You could put melted butter in there too. That would taste good too. Yeah, of course. Okay. It would. Okay, we're gonna add some. <laughs> Add a little brie. brie cheese. Put some brie cheese yes. in there. Yum. We're going to add some spicy jam. Oh, spicy jam with the jalapenos. Always. Oh, of course. And then when you put the peach at the end? Oh, I'm gonna put I the like peach that. In. Oh, then you put the peach. Uh-huh. Yes. Put some peaches in there. a couple of these. Don't forget the jalapenos. Okay, this is really spicy, oh. so usually you would use a glove. I like keeping the seeds in there. I don't know about you. Yeah, I like it. So either use a glove or use a spoon. Don't touch it. Don't I've, rub your eyes. I've had some bad experiences. Yeah. Juice going in my eye. You can't it's do the thing. jalapenos and you get in your eye and you're all thing. jacked up. So. Oh, balsamic vinegar? Oh, that's afterwards. Okay, sorry. Hold your horses. Okay. We put that in the oven. You got this. Okay, I could do this so far. Boom. This is so great. Okay, where's our finished ones? Da 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 da. da, da, da. Magic oh, right of TV. Where are they? Where are they? Okay, I got them. I think this is them. Oh, there we this go. Oh, there we go. That, look how fast that hey, was. Come on over look here. Look at that. It was on the other side of I'll show you. Sasha. Look now we have. Oh, these are nice yummy, right here. Toasty. Okay, then you put the. Then drizzle. you put the. Just do a nice. Wait, I'm oh, sorry. Great. What are you putting on top? Let me Balsamic make sure. Reduction. Let me make sure there's no poison in there. Hold on. Make sure it's okay. <laughs> so Sasha, I love anything that's little bite size. Good. And this right? is how you started Thanks. your oh, yeah, blog. Thing. I did. I started a blog. Um, my cookbook is five years in the making. Uh -huh. I really wanted to do a cookbook that was easy and basically showed you how to party plan without the stress. These are good little party snacks. They are. They're crowd pleasers. They're so easy to do. You can do something like this with five other recipes right. and not be worried about hosting. Did you know at the time you're making the videos that it would turn into this and then lead to a cookbook? I didn't. Actually, to be honest, the videos came afterwards. So this was this. already in the process and I wanted to share this with fans to see if they were interested and I was okay. so lucky because I had good feedback. Okay, wait, Sasha, come down we got here more and just stuff tell here. us because yes. your Rice Krispie treats are the cutest. Oh my gosh, thank you. <laughs> All right, what's going on here? These are so easy too. I've got a really yummy Rice Krispie recipe in my cookbook, but you can also get them store bought. It's you cute. get some white melting put, chocolate, put some natural food color. Oh, in that's there. not yogurt, that's chocolate? No, that's chocolate. That's okay. white chocolate. It's delicious. You can get these cute little eyes for Halloween. These are in the baking section. Kids will love this. They are not okay. plastic. These ones are edible. You can actually okay. eat them. Oh, that's so cute. I love that, that you what a try cute party yeah. out. Oh, that's Sasha, I Absolutely. love that. Absolutely. What's great about this is that you can create these for any theme. This can be versatile, no matter what it is. Mm. It doesn't what have to be for Halloween. And what, what kind of we punch are we working with over here? So, I, <laughs> this is a delicious pear lemonade. It's, oh, that sounds good. Yeah, pear juice, peach juice, lemonade, and it's super yummy. This Thank has you. food coloring in it. Um, you I, can drink it? You can drink it, I promise. Okay. <laughs> it's not mm. poison. The best part too is you can customize this to your your theme. This has food coloring in it. Nice. Thank you. Salute to you. Wait, Listen, Sasha, check out her cookbook, you. Sasha in Good Taste <laughs> Recipes for Bites, Feasts, Sips, and Celebrations. It's available now. We're gonna be right back after these messages from your local station. I gotta try the popper. You gotta try the popper. Yeah, okay. um, I like so this green.